All right, hey guys, welcome to another one of my videos. And today I'm going to be showing you this computer I built. And it's pretty functional, it does quite a few things. It's a calculator, displays images, accounts. It is a music player. In fact, I'll show you the music player right now. The first song is Tetris. And yeah, I'm not going to be able to show you every little thing that it does, but it's, you know, it displays images, it can display 30 images, and 10 numbers. Over here, it has three USB ports, um, slots, front ports for your microphone, and um, headphone jacks, DVD-ROM, Take a quick look at the back. Some more USB ports, HDMI, DVI, surround sound. Massive uh, power supply back there, by the way. All right, and yeah, there's actually plays two songs, so if I hit this again, it'll stop it, and then one more time. Oh, this is actually Tetris. Yeah, the last song was actually Mario. Alright, and I will show you the calculator. So if you look over here, I don't have these numbered, but the purple is ones, the greens are twos, yellows are threes, and blues are four. So if you go one plus one, you'll get two. And then one plus two, let's take one off and put two there be a little easier for you guys to understand if they were marked. So yellow was 3, for example, so 1 plus 3. And you get 4, and then 1 plus 4. And you get 5. But it's basically just 1, 2, 3, 4, and then the same thing on the other side. So let's take a look at 2s here. 2 plus 2. Four. Oh, there we go. That one didn't want to go at first. So two plus three, and then two plus four, and then. Three plus three and three plus four, and then there's just four plus four to left to do. And you get seven, and let's do four plus four now. And you get eight. Oh, I took it must have lagged up, but you get eight, yeah. <coughs> Over here on the side, those are signs there that help me uh, number it so I knew where all the pistons were. So what's going on there? Let's just take this off and I'll show you something else here. Oh, let's turn off the music too. So over here you could manually um go through the things. So there's images loaded. There's numbers. So there's one, for example. So this one has a set of 10 images. Same here and same there. This one's actually empty. I didn't, I stopped uh, loading them. As you can see, as you press that, it was a counter. Yeah, it got really, got big too fast and the tr signals didn't want to carry. But if you look at the top right corner of the map, see how big it is. Kind of goes off the map too, so. The counter is going right now, so. It only counts up to 10. I could have made it go, I guess, to 99. The screen size wouldn't have been big enough for 100.
times eight and we'll shut it off at nine. Each one automatically resets itself as it cycles through them. It's also a master shut off switch where the escape button would be. And it stopped on 10, so let's just hit it one more time so I don't have to reset it. And it should reset itself automatically with that. There we go. Alright, so these cycle through images, and I'm not going to be able to show you them all, but I'll just show you set 2. Set 3, um, the signal travels really far and it lags up and a lot of Minecraft bugs are created with uh, image set 3. Same thing with image set 2, and the farther the signal travels, the... Um, is the top row so the top row really goes really far those are the ones that usually hang up like it's actually I can see it starting to hang up already yeah and it's actually a minecraft bug it looks like that one puked out on me Reset this. So you can't even reset it. But yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to show you guys, anyways. And I'll make uh, another video showing you guys a little bit more of it. It's basically a little computer desk I made here. Um, little office cubicle style. It's like a webcam up here. I actually put it up there for a little bit more lighting. But alrighty, guys. That's all I wanted to show you. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment, rate, subscribe. Peace.